Hi, I'm Merrick Demand, and welcome back to Let's Play The Mummy Re The Mummy Animated on the PS2. Ooh, lightning bats. Forgot about the lightning bats. A lot of lightning bats. Pick no, we don't need the magic pickup. Is the bridge gonna fall off now? So this is all. These mummy games just keep getting longer. Because the longest up to now was Scorpion King: Rise of the Acadian, which was like uh, I don't know, it was 14 videos, and this is the 15th video of this series. So getting up there. This might be the last one. I don't know. I don't really know how much longer is left in this game. I've never played it before. Which is obvious, by the fact that when I first started, I made clear that I was surprised this thing even exists. And I was incredulous about its reality. Oh! Firebats. Worst thing ever. very hard in this game. Hope we get some more life soon. Yeah, the jar the box has life. That's awesome. This is one of the infinitely respawning firebats, isn't it? This is the part where we just run. <laughs> you know when we get when you get the chance, but if not, don't sweat it, just run. Extinguishing. Ow. Please don't do that again. Please don't do that again. Please just leave me alone. Okay. Fire trap seems over. That's good.
Oh yes, this stressful bit. This was a bad bit of the game. This was, I think, where we were in my most angry video of the game. <laughs> well, that's over. The fire thing. Lightning guy in here, right? Yeah, yeah, there he is. Oh, that did not kill him. Oh, that how did that drag me towards it with by smacking me? Sometimes games will just make physics not work properly just to make your life more difficult. That's kind of the rules. Oh, these guys we can really just kick. Take a few hits, but eh. Ooh, extra life. I'll take that. Thank you. I'll grab this thing too. Let's keep going. Why would we stop now? <laughs> We're only seven minutes in. Now, please don't. Oh, no, you're... The lightning ones don't annoy me as much as the fire ones. Maybe because I have more bad experiences with the fire ones, because they've been around longer. We're gonna have to see some ice monsters or something? Like, um, ice versions of those, or lightning versions of those lava dudes from, uh, First time we did this level. There have been like lightning versions. Okay, so we've already activated those, I guess. Lightning. Okay, cool. That's how you open that door. Good to know, good to know. Maximum effort. 
Let's do this. get that light back there so we can just skip it. We save state all the time anyway, so it doesn't really matter.
look ahead. Or do we have to put all the heads back now? Again. That would really, really suck if we had to do that again. Yeah, we gotta do that. Bad idea. Lightning takes so much mana too. He's got a full mana heal up on here, which we can on this plinth. Which we, on this plinth, which we can now easily get. Those are not words that are supposed to be set together. To save on on mana, we're going to um, charge the things after we put them in, like so. And charge that. It's already that's already locked in, so we don't need to do, deal with that. But we got to grab this one. of Imhotep are everywhere. And you can't Relax. act at all. Wow. The manacle will protect him. And don't forget that he's the only one of us who can deactivate the energy flux. If he's not back in five minutes, I'm going after him. You are awful. Wow. I can feel a perturbation in the magical web. 
Imhotep's shadows are being pulled back into darkness, Alex has succeeded. Oh, like father, like son. I knew we could oh, do it. Didn't. We're headed for China and the last energy channel. Let's just hope that Imhotep has been weakened enough so that we can beat him back into the world where he belongs. Huzzah. We're headed for the final combat. Okay, let's do this. Uh, You're here now? Okay, Imhotep was just suddenly there. Yes, Tut. We're gonna have to go back in there. I'm just as worried as Tut, Alex. Hey. I just found an ancient tome. There's a passage that refers to the fortress. What does it say? It was written that an ancient guardian once protected the fortress we get to fight the dragon? from trespassers. Oh, we get to fight the dragon, don't this we? This was certainly very long ago, and it's probably only a legend. But I hate to think what archaic and angry souls those shadow monsters might have awakened. A guardian who's grumpy in the morning. Thanks for the warning, Mom. I'll pay extra attention. I promise. I don't trust this kid. He's not very bright. He's also Corey Feldman for some reason, so... Okay, we're in China now. Gonna save. Wow. back in China again in the final mummy game. I'm not counting the mummy demastered. Exist, which I'm not convinced, a fact of which I'm not convinced. Another health upgrade? Life upgrade, yes. Okay, we gotta move. We're, we're in a bad, bad situation. Uh, the targeting system in this game is awful. Oh. To be fair, most everything in this game combat related is kind of awful. But, <laughs> have like the quarter staff we use in the show it would be better like some kind of melee weapon 
that is in our fists. Ice bats. I don't know why. Don't hate them nearly, nearly as much as I hated the fire bats. They're functionally identical, but they don't make me as as angry. I don't know why. think this is fun. I really don't get... I will never understand why people find platforming fun. It's one of those things like country music. I get that logically someone in the world must enjoy it. But I honestly don't see how. Oh, 
don't like those things. They're not nice. Save. So this this is definitely not going to be the last episode. I think this is going to be about 16 or 17 videos for the series. This game's really bad. <laughs> Soldiers are a lot easier to kill. There's just one ice bullet, and then you shoot them. Then you kick them, and they shatter. Trade-off, though, the ice soldiers are at, you can actually kill, find in melee combat effectively. fighting you, sir.
another one. Five there, mainly because it's harder for them to dodge that many at the same time. kind of clear this area a bit before I call it a video for the night. Night for me. I don't know when you're watching this. I know I blow them at uh, 6 a.m. my time. Blow them. I mean, I have them actually scheduled to upload then. So that there's a more regular system for, for people who like to watch my stuff a lot. Also, so if I get called away on uh, some kind of thing that happens family-wise, I can uh, just, I, it's set to go and I don't have to be around if I need to forget something. It's just convenient to have it set up as one. Well, that's all we have there because we have no bullets left. There they are. There's some bullets. Oh dear. He's very tough, isn't he? Bullet bullets, please. Thank you. Do things around here. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Hmm. Well, um, I really don't want to go do all that crap again, so I've been Mark the Mad. I'll see you all next time. Grumble, 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 grumble. Hi, thanks for watching. This has been played and recorded by me, Merrick D'Amato. The art was by Rafael Agrona. You can find a link to their commission page in the description below. And if you, li if you like this video and want to see more like it, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time. Ciao!